Good morning, everybody. Welcome to online class, Priyadarshini High School. I am Mrs. Sastra, your social teacher. Today, we are going to learn about the continents. We have seven continents and five oceans. Okay. So, what is a map? I am going to tell you and the types of maps. Okay. Okay, children. Listen to me carefully and try to understand. So, there are seven continents on earth. What are they children? I am going to tell you. Listen to me carefully and try to see in the picture also. So, they are Asia, Australia, North America, South America, Europe, Africa and Antarctica. So, each continent has countries. Okay. Her continent ko countries hai. So, the largest country area largest country area wise is Russia. So our country India is the seventh largest country in the world. So in which continent is India located? Can anybody tell me? Yes, our country is located in the continent Asia, which is the biggest continent. Okay, children? Good. Now, I am going to tell you about the oceans. There are five major oceans on earth. The first one is Pacific Ocean, Atlantic Ocean, Antarctic Ocean, Arctic Ocean and Indian Ocean. So, India is the only country that shares its names with an ocean that is Indian Ocean. Okay. So, Pacific Ocean is the largest of all them. Konsa sabse bada ocean hai? Pacific Ocean. Theak hai? So, India is surrounded by water on three sides, which is called as peninsula. Okay? Ko bolte children? A land covered by water on all the three sides. This is called an peninsula. So, the Indian Ocean lies at the tip of the Indian Peninsula. Okay? tell you about the maps. First we will learn what is a map. Map is a drawing on a flat surface. What is a map? It is a drawing on a flat surface. Okay. So what does the map show you? It gives us the relationship between the concern and nearby locations. Yani nearby Locations, जो अपने नजदीक में locations है, further places है, उसका clear size, उसका clear picture, shape, okay, of the countries. We can see in the map the seven continents, five oceans, islands, everything we can see in the maps, okay. So, two types of maps, okay, one is physical map and the other is political map, okay. So, in the next class, I'll tell you what is the physical map and the political map shows you. Okay? Tell you what is Atlas. A book that has a collection of maps is called an Atlas. The book that has a collection of map is called an Atlas. Okay, children? Is that clear? Okay? I think all whatever i told you children please watch the video again and again if you didn't understand and try to understand whatever is told because i'm going to take a test in that okay children thank you have a nice day